Hello there, my internet family. What's up? Guys and dolls, I feel like I haven't sat down and had a chat with you in so long. My favourites videos, I think, have become my favourite videos to film because it just feels like a conversation and a chat. I've got lots of favourites this month, like beauty and lifestyle kind of things, and I really want to know what yours are as well. So just throughout the video, if you get you know, flashes into your brain of something amazing you've tried that you want to share with me and everyone else, make sure you leave it in a comment and grab some tea. I'm actually having this, right? This is called the Love Tea by Puka. And um, it's really, really nice. I have it in my little Tinkerbell mug, but um, it has rose, lavender, and chamomile in there. And it's just like a really relaxing tea. But yeah, get your tea, sit on your arse, and I'm gonna chat at you for a few minutes about things. Feck off fruit flies. I brought a piece of fruit in here and like, it kind of went a bit rotten. And now there's an army of flies. <laughs> okay, first thing is a makeup thing. And this is something I used to use a lot. Recently rediscovered it because of the time of year. My skin is getting a bit drier and stuff. And I wanted something really natural. This is actually really great for back to school and university guys. If you are looking for a makeup that you can wear that looks really natural and beautifies your face. This is the Vichy Idelia BB Cream. I love saying that for some reason. It's got an SPF 25 and it protects you from all the different types of rays. It actually also helps with dark spots. So if you've got pigmentation issues similar to me, um, this will be great for you. I love that it comes in this really pale milky shade and it's really moisturizing and hydrating. It's basically your own skin but better. You know that kind of look where it just blurs out all the fine lines and spots and everything like that. Really enjoy using this. And if I need like a bit of extra coverage, I use the Vichy Dermablend concealer or something like that. And then also this little discovery, I love this. I've been wearing a lot of the MAC, you know the new MAC times nine palettes with the little, there's like nine little shades in them. Um, but I was looking for like a cheaper alternative to share with you and I actually definitely prefer this. I swatched them against each other the other day and I really, really like these. This is the collection Eyes Uncovered Nude Bronze Palette. There's a few different palettes and they're all kind of real neutrals and stuff, but this is just so nice. It totally rivals the Urban Decay Naked shadows, I think, anyway, like, I might not be right because I'm not an expert, but <laughs> I just think that they blend really well and they look lovely. I'm wearing them today and they're really easy to use. Excellent. Okay, a skincare thing. This is just like a face mask that I've been using for the last two weeks and really purifies the skin a lot, but it's just so relaxing to use. You know, when you find a skincare product and you get excited to use it. That's what this is. It's the No Clogs Allowed Self Heating Mask deep pore detox one from Soap and & Glory and you basically apply it to your face and it goes a bit blue and it heats up and just works a treat. Um, and it's available in drugstores too, so go check that out. And then in terms of like my body, okay, I've got three things. This one is so gorgeous. I found this in Boots Pharmacy. It's the Ted Baker London Body Souffle and it has the scent of jasmine and neroli and sandalwood and musk and stuff like that but like it is just such a gorgeous body product i love like rubbing it all into my skin after my shower and i don't know jasmine used to be one of those things that i just didn't really get the attraction to it but i'm so drawn to the scent now i think it's really sexy and you know ted baker is just like the height of sophistication and class i love it and um, then from lush i've got two things this is um well no i'll go this one first because it's cuter and funnier <laughs> um it's called silky underwear dusting powder and it's kind of like baby powder it's a little bit more rough in texture but you know it sounds saucy and dirty and nutty and it has cocoa butter in it which is great for your skin i just like putting that all over my body over the lotion once it's dried into my skin and then I smell like Jasmine. I wish I smelled like Jasmine from Aladdin though because I bet she smells great. She's beautiful. The Lush Dream Cream. Okay, if you have really dry skin, invest in this. I know it smells like a hospital. It's not that <laughs> attractive in scent, but it is so effective. Only word I've got has oat milk, rose water, olive oil, cocoa butter, all that kind of stuff. But um, I like to apply this to the rough parts of my skin. So knees, elbows, my hands, feet, things like that. It is a dream. 
hence the name. <laughs> Giving a little shout out to this whole range because I love them. The VO5 Nourish My Shine stuff. This is their heat defense miracle illuminator and like it does make my hair a lot more shiny than it is naturally but they've got lots of great heat defense products and yeah just protect your hair especially going into like the winter and things like that if you're going to be using lots of heat styling or in Christmas just get some nice heat defense product and use it. A couple of very random things extra white bubble mint chewing gum has not left my side this month love it. I don't know exactly what to say about you but I love you baby I love you be mine. <laughs> if you're having a brain fart get a journal I have this little one and it's by Moleskin and I love the fact that it's really bendy and floppy and not hardback. It's just one of those things I can just walk around and be all like, yeah, I got my journal. I've been having a lot of thoughts recently and I'm spilling them into this because it helps me work through them and discover more about myself and become more self-aware and more mindful and things. So yeah, get a journal. I love this locket, okay? I saw this in my local jewelers. It's a rose gold locket and it looks quite old fashioned, but also quite modern, which is why I really like it and it reminds me of Harry Potter. It's rose gold and it has a kind of a little purple background, backdrop thing inside it. I can't describe jewelry, I'm not gonna pretend that I can, but that's not why you're here. I think this looks really beautiful. It's a classic piece I can just throw on with um, like a shirt or anything like that. I just wanted like a me necklace, you know? Um, and it was quite expensive, but I wanted to treat myself to some jewelry because like I haven't been bought jewelry in years, probably like, I don't even know how long it's been. And yeah, you don't have to wait for a male or a lady to buy you a jewelry, just buy one yourself. My favorite food thing, okay, I've been just having such cravings for chocolate this month, all month long, and salted caramel, anything. And what I've been really liking to eat is dates, so fresh medjool dates they're called, and peanut butter. So I have this peanut butter, I'll just go get it. Yeah, so this peanut butter, it's the deliciously crunchy one with maple and pecans from Marks and Spencers. I just love any peanut butter really, like I'm not going to be picky, but look how much I've eaten in like a week. Oh my god. Um, so I'll get a date and not dried dates. Now these are like fresh ones and you can get them at food markets and like in health, like fruit shops and stuff like that. Or like I just got these in Marks and Spencers. Tesco sells them as well. But I'll open it up. So these are really sweet and caramelly and they taste like toffees. And I'm going to be really super disgusting right now. I'm going to get some peanut butter onto my little finger and I'm going to put it inside the date and then I'm going to close it up and smush it together and it's like a little Snickers sandwich. It's the perfect bliss point between sweet and salty. Mm. And it kills like every craving ever. I love it. And like this gives you a nice hit of fiber. There's lots of fiber in dates and also healthy fats from the peanut butter. Mm. I've been listening to so much music this month, really kind of like powerful, you know, out walking kind of music. I love Sia so much and the song I've had on repeat since last month is Fire Me Gasoline by Sia and that like pretty much just all her music, I just adore her. A new discovery is a band called Don Bracco, I think that's what they're called, but they have some really, really great songs and also that song. I can't feel my face when I'm with you. I'm so like obsessed with that song. It's so catchy. Ugh. I'm gonna say slán, which means goodbye in Irish. And I'm gonna leave you with another Irish YouTube channel that I absolutely love. These girls have just such great personalities. Um, I've met Karen now quite a few times and yeah, I just wanted to feature them as my channel of the month and I hope you check them out. Just lap up their positivity and let them know that I sent you. And now I'm gonna go, cause Riyadh is coming to stay. We're having a sleepover. He is my baby, I just love him. And I, we're going to film as well, I think. But yeah, bye. Hi everybody. Thanks so much to Melanie for featuring us in her monthly favorites this month. Hi, Smelly. I love Melanie so much. Like she is one of the most positive, enthusiastic people that I've ever met and she's well. so genuine and we've met her a few times and she's just always so nice and um, she reached out to us and said that she wanted to feature our channel in her monthly favourite oh, so I was like thank you. oh my god now I have to like be good but yes this is lovely girly bits I'm Karen I'm Joanne and we are like Ant and Deck when <laughs> we do that I am um I don't know actually which one I want to be <laughs> on our channel we do beauty videos we do random sisterly videos we, we have done some challenge videos in the past Namely the whisper challenge and the jelly bean challenge. Oh god, that was disgusting. I like to eat our fine china. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, do you know?
Oi, Choi. First up we have these Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Lip Colours in the shades It Doesn't Matter because don't buy them. They just felt as dry as tissue paper. <laughs> oh, you have found your three things and you're like, oh yeah, I've got my three for two stuff. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Then something happens. You find a fourth thing. We hope that you come over and subscribe to our channel and have a look and see what we do. And yeah, hopefully we'll see you there. Thanks, Melanie. Bye.